Start recording. Speech off. Hey everybody on YouTube. I'm gonna mute this so it doesn't bug me. Thomas here and Ma Megan here. Hey. Megan and Thomas here is what I should, should say. Um, hi. Uh, welcome to the second video for the day. We are gonna do an unboxing. So I will be right back. Thomas, would you talk to these lovely people for me? I would love to. All right, you guys, a uh, few things here. First and foremost, of course, please subscribe to my wonderful girlfriend Megan's channel. Um, it's an awesome channel, so please subscribe to it. Also, if you'd like to, you can check out my YouTube channel. Um, I do, I do, uh, my YouTube channel is not designated just to one thing or one topic. I do many, uh, many things on my YouTube channel and I talk about many things, um, but anyway, um, if you'd like to subscribe to my channel, my channel name is my first and last name, uh, which is T-H-O-M-A-S-A-C-O-C-E-L-L-A. -L -L -A. And you can also, if you want to check out my friend Nikki Wonderlick's YouTube channel. W she talks about things like mental health. Thank you very much. And she talks about things like uh, mental illness and blindness and uh, many other awesome things. And then... Please check out Yellow Brick Cinema. That's a YouTube channel. Like you can listen to um, different music, like music for meditating, music mm -hmm. for studying, and deep sleep music. And uh, last but not least, check out uh, depre check out depression depression bleh, depression to expression. That is a awesome YouTube channel for people who have uh, mental illness. So that is that, and I am very excited for this unboxing video. Well, so am I. Let's get to it. Shall we? Yeah. Um, living room here in a box of cards. I'm expecting two packages in the mail. Well, not expecting because I have those packages now. But I'm looking forward to opening one of these said two packages. I can't do an unboxing tomorrow necessarily unless Thomas, like, do you want to be with me in every unboxing? Because if you do, I think we might need to wait till Saturday night, which we could, because it would be a special birthday present, you know? <laughs> yeah, we, we, can, we, can, uh, we can do it on Saturday night. Okay, but it's, yeah, so you won't be getting an unboxing video until Saturday night um, after this. So, I don't know, I picked, the, I picked the least widest box because it was on top and... I just kind of, it was stacked there that way, I guess. So I decided to open that tonight, but I am expecting something in the mail, and I don't know if this is what, I mean, I'm expecting um, two things in the mail right now, at least, so I don't know if this is the one that I'm expecting tonight. I don't want to give it away, but, because um, I like to do the big reveal when it's open, but I am waiting for something that I, that I need um, from one of the zippers, one of the babies. Okay. This is me untaping the tape. Oh, look, it's a box! That's what I ordered. I did order a box. I love when people are reliable <laughs> online and send you what you order. You know, I did order a box. Thank you, guys. Careful. I think there's something inside of it. I think I know what it is. And thank you to the guy. Yep. Yep. Oh, no, it is what I thought. Good! Oh, this is great! So, Dakota, as I put in the last video with Dakota's car seat, she has, baby Dakota, has a new car seat. Problem was, it was a cheap dud. Like, it, it, I'll, I'll just open this first and explain this to you, but okay, is this a, is this a hard shape? No! Oh my goodness, Thomas, it has a cover on it! Hey guys, I'll show you this, this to you. I don't know how it works. Oh, I think you just strap it and strap like that. That's, I think this is gonna work. I'm, I'm giving, keeping my hopes up. Thomas, clutch your fingers. <gasps> There's a balloon in here. Why is there a balloon in here? That's random. There's a balloon in here. <laughs> I'm gonna play with the balloon. Oh my, I'm gonna play with the balloon now. Wee! Look, you guys, it's a balloon. Look, Thomas, look, can you see the balloon? It's a balloon. I'm geeking out. It's a balloon. See it? Oh my goodness. I love it. Can you please comment? I can't see. What color is this balloon? Thomas, do you know what color this balloon is? It's my favorite. It's, I love it. It's perfect 
size and everything. <laughs> Woo! Yeah! It's a balloon! Wee! All right, I'm done. No, but I love this thing. I'm going to name him. Well, Thomas, do you want to name him for me? Please? Sure, we'll name the balloon Milo. That is the most touching thing I've heard all day. Hi, Milo. How you doing? I love that name. I'm great. How are you? Oh, nice to meet you. You want to be friends? I'd love to be I friends and have some kite. I cannot believe. Oh, the internet sent me a free balloon. I can cry. I love you guys, eBay people. And online people. And whoever people I got it from. Man! I'm pretty happy right now. Hi. Hello, I'm talking into the balloon because I'm going to play with this. Okay, stick it. Rub it on your arm and stick it to the wall. It'll stick. It's sticking. It's sticking to the wall. That balloon is not going anywhere. It is sticking to the wall. Look, I'll, I'll show you guys. I love learning these things in science class. This is no longer an unboxing video. This is a balloon video. Look, look at it. Look at it. Look. Stop whatever you're doing and look. It's sticking to the wall. Thomas, are you, are you paying attention? Are you look, averting your eyes to the wall over there? That is a balloon filled wall. I am so happy. His name is Milo. His name is Milo. If any of you don't know the, about the show Milo Murphy's Law, that's why I like the name Milo. Okay, well, moving on now. <laughs> it's sticking, it's sticking to the wall. I'm not gonna pop it, I don't wanna pop it. I don't wanna pop it. Alright. I'm gonna see if you can hear the static electricity with this. Listen. No, you can't. But if I bring that back, it is still. Oh, it's not sticking no more. Come on, Milo. Let's, uh, let's eat breakfast now. Okay, what do you want? You want some cereal? Because you were just born? You want some cereal? Oh my gosh. Where am I going to put this, Thomas? Like, I don't really know where to put a balloon, but I love this thing. I love it. I can't, uh, I can't even I believe, know. I cannot even believe that they included a free balloon. Like, they didn't tell me they were going to Thomas. They shipped it and everything. And well, that's I, awesome. I don't, I don't see anything dangerous about it or anything, or, you know, you know, because you never know. But it's, like, <sighs> are we still recording? I think I got a reminder on there, huh? Stop recording. Button. Yeah, we're still recording. Camera, stop recording. Button. Speech off. You still there, Thomas? Yeah, I'm still See, here. I don't know why they included this, but they did, and it's one of the most amazing. I, I've never, I, I have never seen that in a in a box before, and I am so, I'm so happy about it. Wow, that's awesome. Did you expect that? Cause I sure didn't. No. Thank you, guys. And not only, not only that, but his name is Milo. <laughs> well, where should I put Milo? I don't know where to put him. Can you I don't put wanna, him in your room? Well, I could. I, I don't like storing balloons because I don't want to pop him. But you know what? If I pop him, we can go to the balloon store. Get another one. This is going to yeah, be I'll my birthday you. balloon, though. Because my birthday's coming yeah. up. I'll, I'll take you to the balloon store. We'll go get I, some I could cry. I'm so happy. Okay. Hmm. All right. Okay. That, that was... Back to work, everybody. Okay, okay.
Yes, I would love to. So, yeah, you guys, pretty exciting stuff. Awesome unboxing video. And, um, yeah, I'm looking forward to doing another unboxing video on uh, Saturday night. And, uh, yeah. So, uh, yeah, you guys are awesome, man. You guys are awesome. Mm -hmm. Thanks, guys, and, for... Oh, go ahead. And remember, and remember, always, guys, keep going up. That's my slogan! <laughs> But you can share it. Um, there's a box. Now, where is my person? I want to tell you. Oh, I want to tell you what's cool. I don't know how this one will be. Okay, this is the real thing that I wanted to tell you guys about. I didn't just order a balloon, but I was so happy about it. I don't want to break this. This is called a Greco. Do you know what this is? Ta well, you have a hand. Do you know so far that's for Dakota, right? It's, yeah, I told you actually. It's a car seat. It's a Greco car seat. All and right. it rocks back and forth as well. Oh, nice rock. Listen, listen. I'm rocking it. Nice, huh? I don't that have any nice. rockers. It just sits like that, huh? Uh. Yep. Yeah. And then you pull the handle up gently. So it does Oh, nice hand. I like it. I like this. This is very sturdy handle. It rocks. It sits just poised in the middle there. I don't know how it will be if the baby is too heavy, but... As far as I know, it's for an 8 to 12 inch doll, so somebody like Dakota or Ashlyn, who is doll size, preemie size, should be able to have one like this. Now, this isn't a, a car seat that is safe for real, genuine, living, breathing, human babies that will one day grow up to be um, something famous in this, in this world, like a lawyer or a doctor or whatever. Um, this is a... Um, car seat for a for a doll or a premature reborn or something like that so i just want to make that clear okay i'm going to show you viewers now the car seat because i'm sure you don't want to stare at my ipad all day oh. stop camera chooser I'm so afraid that i'm going to hit the done off. button before before the <laughs> before uh i'm finished here this is the car seat see she'll just rest right in there and see that the beautiful it's not actually a cover well it is there's a little bit of a cover there a headrest or whatever but there's a it's a cross strap, so I think you would kind of... Oh, this is hard to film with one hand, like they said, but buckle baby, you know, in. Like, take off the... Come on, you. It's one of those moments when I wish I had a tripod or something. You, you know, take off the Velcro. And kind of, uh, I'm terrible at this, but safety first. You buckle the baby in with the Velcro. Now, it's Velcro, so obviously this isn't real car seat safety. But it, it does the purpose for what I, I need it to. So basically, you get the, the idea. I know you do too, Thomas. Um, you, and I know I'm moving it around because I, I, I'm glad we have a good connection tonight with hearing each other, but I try to put you guys on my iPad where Thomas is so we can hear Thomas. But you're back on my iPad now. Um, and this is the Velcro strap. You can probably hear it. And then it just kind of comes undone like that. I hope I don't destroy it and have to have someone like my dad to help me, but my dad's an amazing helper if I do. Uh, okay, and then we have that sewn up thing there. I think you just kind of Velcro it together, I'm guessing, and kind of strap baby in. It, it really is it's a toy, like it's a, it's a doll car seat for a doll baby, but it serves a purpose, and I think it has a tie on the back just to kind of tie it together, but I love the design of this. It's not just one of those cheap plate, fr it's like frisbee shaped, let's plunk baby in here and kick and pretend to carry around, and hopefully she doesn't fall out, but if she does, she's a baby. It's not like one of those... Let's just slap something together for a four-year-old who doesn't know anything. I love things that are thought out well for children, like this thing. Um, and this is definitely a great and wonderful design. You can, I mean, you, you still have to angle your hand as you can kind of see when I'm carrying it around. I have to kind of angle my hand. But first of all, there's no baby in it. And second of all, like, just lost my train of thought. Second, and second of all, you know, it's, it is it is a small plastic thing, but it's it's very sturdy. It's 
It's not like the other one I had, where you just let's plug baby in and just play house. Okay. It's, it's, they took the design seriously, and I love them for it. Love them for it. Um, so it still has plastic on the bottom, but let's test this out. What do you think, Thomas? Should we should we get one of the babies and place her in it and see if if it works? Let's do it. I mean, she might still fall out, but okay. I'm gonna try this with. Because it's my YouTube video channel, I can do what I want, and you guys just deal with this stuff. No, <laughs> but I'm going to get my uh, first doll, first baby, um, Ashlyn, because she needs some attention, and then I'm going to get Dakota later. So here is Ashlyn. She also has Velcro on her back. She's a baby alive. Those can be doll, baby doll, baby doll. Is it baby or doll? Uh, she's a doll. She's a baby. She's a baby doll. <laughs> um, uh -huh. Now the try me button is on the left, so I gotta turn around. Have you met her, Thomas? Have you heard her? You've heard her on a little bit. There she is. She's yeah, she's you want to see her? Person? Yeah. Hi. She's gonna. She's, she's adorable. This is Ashlyn, Olivia, everybody. I don't know if you can see her, but I'll pick you up. You're on camera. See, this is her. She's so cute. She's precious, and I'm holding her head like you would a real baby because that's how you hold a real baby. You don't do what my dad did and stink and put her on the counter and let her sit by her. I mean, by herself, unless you want her to have some kind of talent show or something. She's a baby. Hold her head. Do you want to say hi to Thomas? Oh, she's making new sounds, too. Are you hi, Ashlyn. She's shy. Are you shy? Are you going to talk to... You see your car seat, don't you? You want to talk, you want to, uh, talk to some of these people on YouTube here? You want to say hi? Okay, they want to say hi to you. Don't say hi... No, say hi to Thomas. To say hi to him. She doesn't like you, Thomas. I don't know why. She doesn't. She's not used to you. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> oh, fussy baby. Yeah, yeah. You want your mom and your dad, right? Well, he's kind of like your dad. I don't know. Yeah, that's your. You want to go in? You want to be strapped in? Let's find out if you work, because I hope you do. Because I paid good money for this, and I don't know what else to spend it on. All right. Putting her in. Oh, she looks good so far. She kind of fits. Her her feet dangle over the side a little bit, but kisses, kisses. I know. Big, big kisses, Does that Ashlyn. Tickle? Does that tickle? Do your toes tickle? Yeah. <laughs> tickle, tickle. Oh, you're so, you're so cute. She'll turn her head to whichever direction you're, you're speaking too, Thomas. I love you. <laughs> you're so cute. <laughs> okay, where's her? I'm gonna. I like that. I, I like that her head supported. I know. I, I, I'm just checking your Velcro straps are first. Ah, oh, there. There's your one. I think you put that one on the outside, and then you put the other one, which you guys have no idea which one I'm referring to, on the inside. I'm coming! We gotta be safe here, Dakota. Safety first, my girl. At, not Dakota, Ashlyn. I thought, oh, I'm forgetting names, like an old grandmother or something. <laughs> okay, put your Velcro strap over there. Put your hands up, please. You'll need to know how to do this from your kindergarten. Raise your hand for the teacher. All right. Now, I think we just strap it over there. This is very much easy for a doll, but... Don't try this at home with a real baby, like a real genuine baby. It's not safe. All right, let's see if she likes it. Mm, put the straps together. Are the straps together good enough for you yet, Ashlyn? Yeah? You think Mommy did a good job? Okay, because Mommy's not perfect, but, you know, she tries. She tries. Are you, are you happy? Yeah? Are you so happy right now? I know. I'm just excited that you get your own car. Yeah, it is. There she is. She's strapped in, and I think... Oh, you're so cute. I'd like to say she fits. I'm really happy with this so far, you guys, though, because this is... It's an 8 to 12 inch car seat for an 8 to 12 inch doll. It's not like one of those big 24 inch ones, because she's just too, too big, too small for, for that. And... Oh, you wait till turn your turn, and she... 
But no, this is really good. I'm glad she's in there. And she looks strapped in. I'm just moving her. Oh, her head is supported really well. I know you want out, don't you? I'm, gonna, I'm just, I hope, see her head has to come up here. Okay, it's all right. And then it comes up there and then it kind of, oh yeah, it folds down like that. Oh yeah, I like the, the way it folds, cool. And it folds down to her feet. I don't like that because she's crammed in, but if you put it in the middle, that should just be in the middle very gently. And then I hope if I carry her around with her head supported like this, that it should work. I'm holding her up now and I'm carrying her I like this. It's comfortable in your hand and it fits really well and it's perfect size for her. I'm just gonna do the tilt test. Oops, 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 I don't like that. Cause that's, I know, it's scary, I know. No, you can still breathe, you're fine. But it's just, if you tilt it too much, is she gonna fall out? Oh, a little bit. Yeah, she's leaning out there, yeah. But she's still strapped in that she doesn't completely fall out, but you do need to be very, very gentle. But I don't know what else you're gonna get that's better than this. And, you know, she is a doll baby. A doll baby, I can't call her a doll, it doesn't seem right. She's not just a plunk doll that you plunk in there. She is a doll though, and she, she, uh, needs extra care because she's smaller. I don't know if you can tie the tights, pops tight like that. I guess my dad would need to help me with the rest. And the carrier part is a little flimsy. So you gotta be careful. But basically you can carry her around really, really gently. And I mean, if you're careful enough, yeah, she goes forward a little bit, but if you're careful enough, she's still supported well now. I mean, you do have to be careful. I'm not a little four-year-old. Believe it or not, I'm not four. I'm four and a half. I'm not, I'm not a little four-year-old with uh, little hands. I'm a big mommy with big mommy hands. So if you, even if you're a parent of a child who has a doll car like this, you still gotta be careful. But I'm so thankful and blessed that, to know that she has a carrier that she carries, that you can carry her around in. And I mean, she is just precious. Like it's so small, it's so junior size, it's cute. Thomas, it weighs about, and viewers, it weighs about the size of a book, maybe, not like a big, huge carrier. And she's just there as a baby doll. And she's adorable. And I'm babbling now, so she's she's sleeping with her eyes open again. Stop doing that. It creeps me out. And But you can, like, see? Really good, steady. I like how she rocks back and forth. I want to put her up on the table here so I'm not crawling down and acting weird. I don't know if I like... Yeah, you can kind of... Stick the stick a few little things in there, but it's it's tricky. But if you know what you're doing, it might work. And I'm just gonna test this out some more. But oh no, that's a middle. And yeah, she just kind of she kind of sits in the middle there, which is nice. But basically, a little heavy. But basically, I think she rocks better on the floor personally. And even then. The handle moves more than the rocker, I see. But it still works, basically, it still works. And if anything, you can take her out and put her in your arms and rock her if you need to. But see, if you just go like this, it's not really rocking, making a rocking sound, but it's, it's kind of trying to. Or you could just kind of rock the edges there if you really, really want it. Or you could put, oh, there's different levels that you can put it up too. I didn't know, okay. Yeah, you put it in the middle there. It's kind of sloppy still, but. And yeah, it's still kind of loose. So you could do that too. You could kind of rock it back. I know you can't see what I'm doing, Thomas, but you can kind of rock it like in the middle there. And you can kind of hear her rocking yep. back and forth. Yep. Ooh, she's really Very annoying. cool, very cool. So she, she likes this. She's And you can actually have a sensor in her that you can actually rock her to sleep. So I'm gonna test this out um, here and there off of YouTube and see what she, does I don't like how she looks like she's kind of gonna fall out, but she she does still stay in there securely, and I'm really happy with her. Um, I'm gonna put her away for a bit and try the app, the Dakota test now. Do you like her, Thomas? She's pretty cool though, isn't she? I just don't like the way that she goes. Oh, I home, love her. That her head doesn't go kind of over like that when you want to put her down. You have to hold her head. But hey, you like you know, like I said, it is. A toy for a five-year-old child kind of thing and you get what you get and I'm, I'm thankful so okay. I, I, I love her unstrapping you good unstrapping you and say goodbye to Thomas now good night, go to bed. yeah I mean Ashlyn sorry little pumpkin <laughs> little Ashlyn pumpkin is always called it she's yeah 
She's our little pumpkin. Pumpkin, my little pumpkin. Good night. Night, night. All right, Ashlyn, time for bed. Good night. Night, Ashlyn. Oh, go over your head. <laughs> Feeding them. For now. Good night, Ashlyn. Stop it right there. I think I'm going to get another one of these because I'm really happy with it and Dakota needs one as well, but I'm not going to get one right away because I want to simulate and test on Ashley first. And Dakota, she's a little bit less clothed than Ashlyn, so um, that's just how she is right now. And she's quieter, obviously, but if I was doing the simulation test, which I'm sadly not, I just gave away my secret. But basically, she's sleeping. But on a technical note, if I was doing the simulation, you'd hear her talking more. She's heavier. Hey, Dakota. You wanna say hi to her? Hey. There's Dakota. I don't like the way she kind of just lies there on her back. It looks like her back is floppy, but it does go over her head easier, the handle. And there's the cover to keep her safe. And I'm gonna Velcro her in too. Hopefully I can find the other Velcro strap. There it is, I didn't lose it. So I mean, it's a really skimpy strap as, as uh, my father would call it, a Mickey Mouse strap, he would call it. But um, I guess some people would call that too. Oh, and her head's to the side, which makes it more realistic. And there she is, she fits quite well. I think perfectly even. Oh my, no, never, no. Well, she slides down a teeny tiny bit which I don't like, and she is heavier uh, for a strap. Um, yeah, and she, yeah, she comes out a little easier. Ooh, boy, but um, maybe I can get a Juvie car seat instead. Juvie eight inches, I'll see. But I really like Ashlyn's, and I'm really testing Ashlyn out well. Dakota, yeah, she's clinging to the car seat from her hands, like, that's not, that's not very safe, and I'm pushing her head up, which is something a parent should not do, because you're going to hurt them, um, maybe with clothes on she'd do better, but she does have slippers on, which is nice, I guess, it just, she is, she is heavy, when I pick, actually, when I pick her up, she wants to slip right on out, so, I'm guessing a small juvie, or maybe test out the car seat that I do have. I I don't know. See, that's why, like, my mom doesn't come in much. And, I mean, she, unless I can find a worker to go with me that gets my doll baby hobby, I, I wish I could go shopping for one of these at the store instead of, you know, because you do take risks when you purchase online, buy with your money, and then get shipped, especially if they don't have an adequate description. That you, you do. And also, you have what happened to me this week, which wasn't good, which... Not to say it was a scam, but I went to buy something for a hundred dollars and When I clicked commit to buy which I wanted to buy it because I thought it was just like a hundred dollars The price went way up and I tried to go back and they said no you agreed to pay for this and I wanted to and I want to still but and I did but it was a big 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 purchase and so I hope that it's a good purchase. But if you're going shopping, you can try things out, okay. and that way you're not concerned about it. But that's that's what happened, and it wasn't pretty. It wasn't fun. Um, Dakota is heavy for this. She's okay if you need to strap her in, but you got to be extra, 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 extra careful. Like no sliding her around. Almost hold her feet whenever you're carrying her. But. I'm gonna look for a micro preemie car seat and see if that works, cause she is preemie size. She's a little bigger than Dakota, or than Ashlyn. And uh, get your dolls mixed up, yeah, get your dolls mixed up. But, um, but at least there's options out there. Um, and I'm happy that she works with Ashlyn, and I mean, who can beat a free balloon? I'm just trying to see if she can rock here. No. And she doesn't even wanna rock, really. Like, she just kinda sits, well, she, she does if she have to. Ooh, this handle, though, is flimsy. But at least it kind of works. And I mean, if anything, you can rock her using the edges. So she works. It's just not as ideal. But 
I don't need to go out like tomorrow and oh no, I need to buy a car seat for Dakota. Like not that not necessarily might not happen. And you still have space in there for certain other things too. Uh, and I have the diaper bag for her bottle and stuff. So basically, guys, that's it for this. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you did too, Thomas, because I really appreciate you being here. I did, I did. See, does that sound like a good rock to you? Right there? Yeah. Yeah, like I'm holding the side, I'm not holding yeah. the handle. Yeah, and I, I, and I did enjoy it. Well, good, I'm glad you did. Um, here's Dakota for her if you want to hold her. Oh, that's good. You can rock her right on the edge too, see? That's better. Yep. So here's awesome. she is if you want to hold her, I'll take her out and you can do what you want. Well she's already unbuckled, so I don't know. This is did I unbuckle her? I don't remember. Poor thing, I'm shoving her head around. She's gonna get a concussion or something. Come here. But anyway, that's uh that's how you test out a car seat, you guys. Woohoo. It's it's work, but it's fun. It's, oh my goodness, I love it. Where is her other Velcro strap? Uh, Thomas, did you take her Velcro strap? No, you didn't. You can even tie the nope. cover tighter, I think, if you need to. So that's nice. Woo! All right! Oh! I'm gonna buckle cool. her up so I can make sure that she's good rocking when she buckles up. Because that's what a good parent does, and I'm a good parent. Amy says so herself when she whines and fusses about bananas in the morning. Mommy, I want a banana in the morning! Why didn't you give me my banana? You stupid jerk! No, I'm kidding. Okay, <laughs> um, this goes down a little bit, yeah, and her soft spot. I don't like this for her, but at least, you know, you can go like that and kind of rock her. It just looks odd. She looks like a clown with feet in the air, but she's okay. Yep. Yeah. It works. I mean, oh. it, it, it works for what I need. It's not like 190 million percent ideal but it works um and then like i said you can carry her around but you've got to support her feet which with a white cane will be interesting anyway um i'll get a premium one so she's good her slippers are on oh and her velcro's still up so i'm gonna unbuckle her and take her back and then we'll be finished so right now she's just lying on my chair. Doesn't look realistic at all. It's not just a baby, but she's okay. See you next time, Thomas? Good. What? You had fun? I did. Yeah, I did have fun. baby feels so real both her hands are kind of loose in the air like she's gonna wave or hit someone and her left hand is like pointing down and her right hand oh. is pointing like up and she looks to me like she's gonna soccer punch someone it's kind of funny but maybe that's what babies look like I don't know <laughs> anyway guys thanks so so much for tuning in thanks mom and thanks all of you other people have a great day and I hope this all works out and I hope that you guys take care of yourselves out there be strong, take care of one another, you know, love your neighbors, love your non-neighbors, and eat your veggies, and always remember, keep going, which way are we going, Thomas? Up! Up! Keep going up. Talk to you soon. Notification, Remi reminder, more, clear. YouTube, back, stop recording. Stop, rec camera, stop recording, button.